I look like freaking Mike Tyson right now. Like I look like one of the characters from The Hangover. Like so I just wanted to hop on here real quick and show you guys that I had a really, really strange accident in what my sister calls a mommy uh -oh moment. Um, as you guys can see, I know you guys can see all of this on my face, my upper eyelid still kind of hurts. Uh, a bottle actually exploded. I was making milk and the bottle top actually exploded open and piping steaming hot milk like exploded and shot right up into my face. So literally like all of this had scolding hot milk just sitting on it for a minute until I could grab something to wipe my face off and start rinsing it off and icing it and everything. So you guys are gonna see me in probably videos for like the next couple of weeks with this going on. I'm hoping it doesn't scar. I look like freaking Mike Tyson right now. Like I look like one of the characters from The Hangover. Like I look like I got maybe like a little henna tattoo gone wrong situation going on right now. And like I said, it, it hurts and my eye still feels a little bit puffy and a little bit heavy. Um, I'm hoping it doesn't scar. My mom went ahead and picked me up some Mederma. So hopefully, like I said, within like the next couple of weeks, it'll kind of kind of go away and be unnoticeable. It, I'm kind of irritated though because we go on vacation in exactly like six days. So I'm like, Ugh. I didn't really want to be looking like Phantom of the Opera for vacation because yesterday I literally had to put like all, a lot of zinc on my face so i was walking around looking like domino from deadpool but yeah if you guys see me like on instagram or on here on youtube with what looks kind of like somebody like sucker pop me it almost looked like a cat decided to scratch me at the same time that is what happened but anyways i'm still excited to go on vacation and i'll get into more about that with you guys a little bit later okay guys so real quick i just wanted to hop back on here and update you all on my eye situation so as you can see it's starting to basically like some of this i guess like scarring or non-scarring healing process has started so as you guys can see it's starting to like scab and a lot of this already flaked off and the same with my eye over here a lot of that already flaked off just from me generally like rubbing my eyes and stuff i've been using this Mederma Advanced gel on it for the last, it's been four days now. So within four days, it started to really help this just disappear altogether. On the first day it initially happened, I actually put a layer of zinc oxide on it. So I had a layer of zinc oxide on it for the full day of day one. And then in the following days, all I used was this. And I'm actually about to put some on right now because the baby is finally asleep and I have, oh, I almost scored it out a lot. I haven't put any on today actually. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. So I'm literally just gonna squirt out a little bit and rub it kinda inward. And I'm gonna still go over the spots that have already kind of scabbed up and flaked off. So I use like a tiny amount, like that much about. It's like literally a tiny, the tiniest drop cause a little bit goes a long way with this. I gotta get up in my eyebrow a little bit because that definitely got burnt as well. And I'm not sure if you guys can even see on my upper eyelid, but it's kind of pinkish where some of that scab cut came off already, which typically happens when you get a really bad or really deep scrape or a burn on thin skin. It's looking rather good considering, like I said, it hasn't even been a week yet since this happened. It's like looking pretty well. And I think this will all be gone within maybe the next three days or so. Either way, I'll hop back on here and give you guys an update. So I'm back on here to give you guys the final update and the scarring is completely gone. I didn't actually hop on here like a couple days later. It's like, what is this? A week and a half later at this point, but it looked pretty much the same like a couple of days ago. I feel like I still have just a tiny bit of darkness right around here but for all of this to have gotten burnt and all of this like my eyebrows included and my eyelid included it looks pretty darn good yeah i mean i feel like you can still see a slight bit of it so i'm gonna continue to put it on and use it but guys this mederma i'm telling you it really do work it's expensive but it does absolutely work so i recommend that if you ever burn your skin especially your face just go ahead and pick that mederma up 
No, none of this crap is sponsored. I don't know how you can even get sponsored unless you planned on burning yourself or you regularly burn your stuff. But anyway, I figured I would just let you guys kind of see the process of me healing from that freak mom accident and yeah so i hope you guys are all having a wonderful and amazing week and i'll catch you on the next video bye